I'm Richard Krause, host of CTV's Pop Life, and this is what I'm watching. This Halloween, we won't be dressing up, we won't be going door to door, so to get into the spirit of the season, I've been watching The Invisible Man on Crave. I mean, you're at home, you can use the whole seat, but I guarantee you, you'll only use the edge. It's not really about the Invisible Man. That's what makes this movie so great. Elizabeth Moss plays a woman who's being tormented by her abusive ex-boyfriend. He was a scientist, he was a genius, but he wasn't a good guy, and he fakes his own death, wears an invisibility suit, and torments her. Police don't believe her, nobody believes her. So then she has to take matters into her own hands and reclaim her life. The movie's secret weapon is Elizabeth Moss. We know her as Peggy from Mad Men, we know her from The Handmaid's Tale, but who knew that she could be the center of a horror movie that involves some action and all kinds of other stuff. It's an astounding performance in a career filled with astounding performances. She's the heart and soul of this movie, and you will root for her from the very opening frame right up until the very end. The Invisible Man takes its title from a story that's 120 years old, but don't don't think of this as a remake. Don't think of it as a reimagination. Don't think of it as a reboot. This is something new, made for the times that we live in right now. I'm Richard Krause, and this is what I'm watching.